And I'm trying the almond chocolate Mr. Beast bar. First time trying it, let's go. Mr. Beast has launched Feastable Chocolate Bars in every single Walmart in the United States. The man himself made a video explaining and confirming this and everybody in his video who has tasted the Feastable Chocolate Bar has liked it. So got my curiosity peaking. Is the Mr. Beast Feastable Chocolate Bar actually good? Well, I sure hope so. I got some people to taste out the different flavors of the chocolate bar and did they like it? We will find out soon enough. But first, let's review the five different flavors of the chocolate bar. We got milk chocolate, sea salt chocolate, original almond chocolate, and canola crunch. I have all of them here with me today, and I'm going to try them all out myself. All right, so I got my five flavors here of the Mr. Beast Feastables chocolate bar. I got to tell you, the Kelowna crunch, that is a mysterious one. And I don't like almonds all that well. Almonds are not really my favorite, but I'm still gonna try it. Milk chocolate, I think I'm gonna like. I'm gonna start with the original chocolate. Look at that, That's, that is so cool. Share and devour. Time has come. Mm. Not too bad. It has the original flavor. I think it has a spike of chocolate in there. For me, it tastes like, I don't know, it's like a whole lot of chocolate together. Like, it's a surge. It's kind of overwhelming, to be honest. Milk chocolate. I'm gonna do the milk chocolate next. So it seems to have broken, but it's chocolate, so I don't really care. Oh yeah, I like that one. Tastes a little bit like Hershey's, but I really do like it. That is, that is good. Now let's try the almond chocolate. Kind of worried about this one. I, I'm not a big fan of almonds, but I like chocolate. I took two bites, so that must be something. As for the almond chocolate, I didn't really taste almonds. Now, I'm not a big fan of almonds, like I said, and I don't really try those, but I, it, they each have their own unique flavors. I've noticed that much so far. Now, Koala, I don't know what that is, but that is very fascinating word to say. All right, so I got the entire share bit. It has a lot of, a lot of um, koala, I guess you can say, in the back. A lot of crunch. I think I taste a hint of milk in there. Very crunchy. So if you like crunch, koala, uh, quinoa quinoa is the way to go I completely forgot to wear my Mr. Beast shirt so that was a little bit delayed but now we are on to the last but not least chocolate at least hopefully not the final chocolate that Mr. Beast will ever make I hope he does come out with more flavors so far all of his flavors have been good we are on chocolate sea salt I when I first heard about this, I was kind of disgusted. 
due to some storage issues, the camera cut out before I did my reveal and then basically in other sense you missed it. So I'm gonna react, re-react to my first time tasting this sea salt chocolate. Oh, what is that? Oh gosh. They actually put sea salt in there? I thought it was a flavor, not actual salt. I actually tasted a crunch. Like I felt it just disintegrate as my teeth grinded it into pieces. Oh gosh. Hey, that one is my least favorite. But the rest of the chocolate bars are very delicious, absolutely magnificent. And now I got to eat them all before they go bad. I don't really think this through, did I? Milk chocolate is definitely my favorite. What flavor of the Mr. Beast chocolate bar do you have? Milk chocolate. We got milk chocolate today, baby. I'm trying the almond chocolate Mr. Beast bar. I got the chocolate sea salt version of the Mr. Beast bar. Oh, I got no chocolate, nothing. Nice you got grass filled milk, and it's only got five ingredients in it. I have a uh, quinoa crunch. And Sharon, because it says Sharon. First time trying it, let's go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. First impression. Really good. First impression. I think it might be better than the Hershey. That chocolate is really good. Is Jimmy going to give you a thousand dollars for doing this? I don't really like it. You don't really like it? Four out of ten. Man. Really? Very man. Out of ten. Too bad. I hate it. You, you hate it? It's bad. It's like a crunch bar. Oh yeah. Mm. Yeah. It goes, it goes very nice, very smooth. You really took that in. Mm. I do. You did. Mm. Mm. It kind of tastes like if you could put hot chocolate in a chocolate bar. It's really nice. Oh, that's, a, that's, a, that's an interesting cake. It's, it's nice and creamy, you know, it's really got that, that like that, that chocolate taste to it. It tastes like a crunch bar, but with dark chocolate in it, mm. you know? Like, like a healthier version. Some really good quality chocolate. I agree. I agree. So you say that it's better than the Hershey. Why is that? Are you on the bus? It's so. It's just more chocolatey. Like it. I know. That's more of a rich hard. flavor. Wow. Yeah, you could definitely yeah. taste like the quality compared to Hershey. Like I, I love Hershey. I'm a big Hershey guy. But first time, this is my first time ever trying Mr. Beast chocolate, and I would say it's a competitor with it at least. It's very oh. good. I highly recommend. This is way better than. Mm. Wow. This blows Hershey's out to park. Would you consider the Feastables better than the Hershey's? No. Absolutely. No, um, absolutely not. No, Hershey's a lot better. 100%. I would. I would. I would. Yeah, I would. most definitely. Yeah. Now, would you ever consider of getting the any other flavor of the chocolate bar again? Oh, uh, yeah. I would love to try. I mean, I, I need to look at what all the flavors are. Milk chocolate is one of my favorites. But I would definitely consider trying some other oh, yeah. flavors because this is really good. No. So you absolutely hate it? I do not. It's a 4 out of 10. Wow. Okay. Bye. Have you ever tried the Feastables again, like in a different no. flavor? Okay. No. I never let you try them all. I mean, yeah. yeah. You like try them all. Nice. nice. Um, would you consider... Oh, I got the chocolate sea salt version. <laughs> I want to have one of 